Welcome to Court Farm Chickens and today we're going to be talking about the bluebell breed. Okay, here we have a very popular hybrid breed, the bluebell chicken. As you can see, they are one of the biggest hybrids. This one is pretty much fully grown. As they age, they do fill out and become quite fat. Uh, they're not an aggressive chicken, but they are generally the alpha hens in a group of hens. Uh, just because of their size and their weight, they generally uh, are in charge of the other girls, uh, but not always. Uh, they have a, a grey plumage, which is described as blue, but it is grey or silver, and the black head. Uh, this one here is almost a perfect example, um, but you can get them with gold on the front, um, which is uh, their relation to the road rocks. If you look at the road rock, they have the gold head and front. Uh, these birds are related and sometimes that colouring does come through. One thing you'll also notice different to other chickens is they have black skin. So the feet are black rather than uh, sort of yellow or pink. They're very uh, placid. A lot of people think these are cockerels because of the size of the comb and the wattle, but they're not. She is a hen. She's actually made a nest and is laying. We will show you the cockerel in a minute and you can clearly see the difference. The cockerels are absolutely stunning. Uh, as you can see, very loving hen. They make really good sort of garden pets. Um, they lay around 250 eggs a year up to 300 they're generally quite large eggs and you do get quite a lot of double yokers from this breed as well they will live happily with most other breeds of chicken uh, right down to bantams but due to the size and weight uh, be careful introducing smaller breeds because when asserting dominance they can um, cause injury without really meaning to uh, lifespan wise uh, average is three to five years but the bluebell has been known to live up to eight years so that is pretty much it for the hen. We will now show you the cockerel. Okay, here we have the bluebell cockerel. Now you can see straight away, there is no doubt that this is a boy. So a lot of people think the bluebell hen is a cockerel because of the size of the comb. But look at that, In there is no comparison. It is an absolutely humongous comb. The wattles, oh, they're really warm. I wasn't expecting that. Um, he looks quite angry, but that's because we've just picked him up and he didn't want to be picked up. So you can see that the cockerel, as well as having the very large comb and wattle, you have these finer feathers on the neck. This is to do with them fighting. They have a lot finer feathers, so harder to get hold of them and pin them down. These feathers just come out. Um, so you don't have this gold like this on a female. And the wing flash as well on the bluebell is one of the most striking of any cockerel. So generally, other cockerel species, they have a small wing flash. This is all the way across the ring, wing, across the back, onto the other wing, and into the tail feathers. Tail feathers, if you'll let us see them. See the traditional curved cockerel tails. Uh, they don't have the green in them. Most cockerel species have the big green feathers, the bluebell cockerels do not. Uh, again with the skin and the feet, you can see the size of his feet uh, is black. And he is just getting his spurs in, he's quite a young cockerel. Uh, he has started to crow, uh, this species also has one of the loudest crows. Um, this one has just started, but a customer that brought one of these from me have said they can hear him clearly through closed windows and doors. Uh, up to six acres away, which is quite impressive. But if you see the size of his chest, he's got a lot of air there to push out. So these also make really good pets, apart from the noise. Um, they're very friendly, not really particularly aggressive. Obviously with cockerels, you have to be careful when cockerels this size, always be careful with young children, especially around uh, breeding seasons. Uh, they will live happily with all species of hen and they will mate all species of hen. But they are a hybrid, so even if you mate a male bluebell with a female bluebell, you may not get bluebell chicks. So there we are. 
I'll try and get uh, a bit of a clip of them together so you can see the size difference between them. But they are absolutely stunning birds. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you on the next one.